I bought this bike used. I do not know the code. I called the dealership in Marietta. They couldn't help me. They no longer sell Ducatis and they don't have the tools to to uh, service them or fix the sensor or anything like that. So we're trying some basic stuff, hoping that it will work. I guess if you put the right code in, it should work. I'm hitting several buttons, but it's not going. Um, as you can see, I keep my motorcycles charged. Oh, God, it's not on, but... Um, I did buy this motorcycle about uh, I say about three to almost four years ago um, <laughs> they never told me the code and I remember asking about it and they said oh just come on back in and we'll help you out but that never worked so what I'm going to do I'm going to Go back to battery, try to pop this open without breaking it, and go on from there. Again, for those of you that have the same issue, this is a 2012 Multistrada. And we're going to try to change the key in the battery fob and see what happens. Okay, guys. I'm using this. I have gloves on because I want the arrow to remain sterile. We got this from a Dollar Tree. I didn't feel like driving 20 miles one way to get any batteries. Uh, 40 miles total, so I just went ahead and got this from a Dollar Tree. Um, I got a screwdriver and a quarter. I'm just going to use a screwdriver. I'm going to stick it here. There we go. I'm going to pop it from here. Let's go look at this. My grandmother lost her only son. You used her grief against her. This has nothing to do with that. Look. I'm going to put the screwdriver in between. My fact. That comes out. We're going to try to slide, push this battery out right between here without messing up uh, the circuits. And uh, if that works, then we we're in the money. As you can see, it's sliding out. We're going to pull it out. It's an energizer. We have that on top. We're going to open this up. Hey guys, I don't have all that fancy camera stuff. I'm not a YouTuber. I'm just providing information how to do things. So we could do it ourselves instead of paying these shops hundreds of dollars for something simple. You know, um, I would have to drive over 100 miles to the, matter of fact, it's like 150 miles to the nearest Ducati dealership. They don't even sell them no more. They do service them, but they don't sell them. And the TV program you hear behind me suits. Give me a second. Good dog, I can't get him out. I can't get it out. Okay, I finally got this out. And I just want to point out. These batteries don't expire till 2025, so they should be good. Uh, I should have put that on the ground, on the carpet, 
Let me blow it off. I'm gonna put this upside down. Label pointing up, slide them in. Carefully set it back in as it's into position. Will this work? I don't know. I hope it does. I hope this was the problem. Okay. All right, look at the bottom. You see two notches. One there, one there. Then you have to look at the clamps right here and there. All right, they kind of hook in. So carefully placing this right back on. I'm gonna turn this TV down so you can hear me talking. We're gonna carefully set this back on and then go on from there. Jeez, who's ringing my doorbell? They just gonna to have to wait. Okay. All right. Feels like it got hung up a little bit. Let's try it again. All right. Let's go downstairs to see if it works on a motorcycle. All right. Moving over to this motorcycle. Fingers crossed. I'm just going to stick it right here. And now we're going to hit the button. Hey, we're in business, folks. So, the reason why it wouldn't start was because the battery was dead. Uh, as you can see, we fixed it. I bought the battery pack from Dollar Tree for $1.25. Um, I didn't drive the 40 miles round trip to get a Energize, energizer batteries that will probably cost around what maybe five or six bucks plus the fuel I'm not doing that it works thanks for watching